We are also tracking new developments in the Lyons sisters case tonight. For the second time in as many days, investigators held a press conference about the murder indictment of Lloyd Welch and the disappearance of the two girls. They vanished 40 years ago from the Wheaton Plaza Mall, and Maryland Bureau Chief Brad Bell went to Bedford County today to learn more about exactly what investigators think happened next. A day after announcing charges against convicted sex offender Lloyd Lee Welch for the abduction and murder 40 years ago of the Lyons sisters, law enforcement officials are revealing horrible details about the case. The motive for the abduction of the Lyons sisters was to sexually exploit, abuse, and defile them. Additionally, new documents reveal relatives of Lloyd Welch say they remember the then 18-year-old carnival worker showing up at this family property on Taylor's Mountain near Bedford, Virginia in the spring of 1975 with two heavy red-stained green duffel bags smelling of decomposition. And they remember those bags being tossed on a fire which burned for days. According to the documents, searches of this property on Taylor's Mountain back in January did find evidence of a fire and possible bone fragments. A Welch cousin who says he helped burn the bags has now been named a person of interest. And police are reapplying heavy public pressure on Lloyd Welch's uncle Richard of Hyattsville, who they say has been implicated by Lloyd. He is observed uh, Richard Welch sexually assaulting uh, one of the Lion sisters. Those that have been involved in the actual crimes or in the recent cover-ups, examine your conscience. And if they don't come forward, the prosecutor says they too could be charged. In Bedford, Virginia, Brad Bell, ABC 7 News.